Noah Rodriguez was only two at the time, but he thinks about 9-11 as the day the Earth stood still, everyone watching as the Twin Towers burned. And that was important because there's a level of humility to that. And I don't think that's going to be forgotten as much. But having lived through the political turmoil of the past four years, and now COVID-19, this medical student says the attacks were just one of many catastrophic events. 9-11 was just another thing on a whole dumpster fire of things that have happened over our lifetimes. The attacks on the World Trade Center undoubtedly changed New York City. But for those who were children during 9-11 or born shortly thereafter, there's some ambivalence as the 20th anniversary approaches. I think most kids, like, they understand conceptually what happened and they can understand that it was a tragedy, but it's not the same thing as living through it. For 16-year-old New Yorker Sarah Malik, 9-11 is a secondhand experience, one told to her by her dad, who worked near the Twin Towers. That disconnect is common. I just think that many of them don't know. It's not that they know, but they don't care. This building in particular uh, is where I lived. Joan Mastropolo of the 9-11 Tribute Museum says the events in their aftermath can become real for younger generations when they hear the stories of survivors. I mean, when I tell them what I, what I saw, what, what I experienced, what I smelled. For 17-year-old Silvana Davi, the day is personal. Her mother was supposed to be in the Twin Towers when the plane struck. If my mom did go, I wouldn't be here. Growing up in a New York suburb where many lost parents, the attack has been a backdrop to her life. She recently wrote a paper about it for her history class. I feel like it should never be forgotten and the new generations that are coming in should learn about it as it is a part of our history. She's also raising money for a 9-11 related charity. I hope it opens other people's eyes to how your life can really be taken in a second and you really appreciate every moment you have. As the country marks the 20th anniversary, future generations will define for themselves what 9-11 means to them. America is burning in a lot of different ways. <laughs> like, I don't know why people have been so focused on this in the grand scheme of things. Tina Trin, VOA News, New York.